Hello guys, it's Toby here, back again on the Snorri Dev Team channel, and today we'll be playing the Stanley Parable. Uh, this is just the demo, and I've heard that the demo is actually a different game from the full version. I'll, I'll have the full version up at another time, but as long as the demo is a full version, might as well play this first. So, let's jump right into it. For those of you who don't know, the original Stanley Parable was a mod for Half-Life 2, and it was a game where you had an announcer, and he would tell you what to do, and you had the choice of listening to, to him or ignoring him. So here we are, the Stanley Parable Demonstration. We've got our boxes, and it's different. Don't start at an office like a different one. You're in a warehouse, it looks like, with soda, I'm guessing. There's nothing you can do with that. Cars. For those of you who play GTA, I really just want to get in one of those and just smash through one of those windows, but that's not the game. One big thing about this game is that it's really focused all around the story. So... Welcome to the Stanley Parable Demonstration. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Oh, my number was 28. I came in at the right time. Uh, anyway, this game is entirely story-based, so it's not uh, its not something that takes a lot of skill. It's something that you just play for the story. It's kind of like a choose-your-own-adventure game, except you uh, you can just go anywhere you want. You can use your, all your creative thought. So three of this waiting room, please wait for your number and then enter 20, yep. Should we wait for our number to be called? Here it comes, 28, let's go. Now this looks like it's probably a map. Ooh, this is, these are probably, uh, these are just images from other games. All right, moving right along, entering this big hallway. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease. Just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The looming uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 minutes or so? Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. Okay. We will... Oh, I thing. get it. You're too yeah. anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility okay. and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. Ooh. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Ooh. So, again, um, so far he hasn't given us any direction that we can ignore, except for, I guess, I don't know what happens if you stand still for 20 minutes, but, um, unfortunately I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna waste my time finding out. So ah, here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press and we'll see what your choice says about you. How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? Ooh. You see, our choices really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our here. minds and souls. Pervert. Ooh. Ooh. That's, uh, that's amazing. 
So yeah, so that was okay. our first decision what on the thing. Had about? any outcome? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. And now we have our choices. We can there are buttons and choices, wall technologies, final choice. I'm assuming we should do this in order. So I mean, you don't have to, obviously. But I'm going to do it in order just demonstration sake. This Dem device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Apparently we are in fact in a video game and there's no danger. Nothing in this room will kill me. The reason why I'm pausing every time the announcer speaks is because it's very important because sometimes what he has to say can be very interesting. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. Ooh. You heard that, guys? I'm good at consuming uranium. Let's try another one. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Boom. Top 4,700, even. I won't go as far as 4,600. Hmm. Top 4,700. You're jealous. What do we have down here? That'll be open eventually. I know that. that that's that got to open. There's no now, here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead. Step into one of them and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. I want to go to discovery or despair. Can I go to somewhere else? Now, now, we have to save at least a few emotions for the full game. Ah. Well, let's start with the discovery. Good news first. It was though and within the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides, the inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping and tearing at the eternal seams. A vessel without a captain, carrying itself like plastic in the wind, hinting at a purpose that was truer in some distant memory, if only it could decipher through time's veneer whose memory it wanted to be. Well, that was interesting. Why don't we go in again? Nothing. So, time for despair. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Perhaps it was the cold I desired most of all. That empress to whom my flesh was always invisible. A hammock for the bones, waiting to be touched and to be known. So, so one interesting thing about this so far is that we haven't had any orders to obey or disobey. Oh, you went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know, and we can take a minute. Well, you know what? I'm feeling like I need to cry. Let me go back to the compliment room. Just, just, because I need to pick me up. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no. You've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay then, what's next? That didn't make me feel better at all. Oh, one more. Oh no, we can't even push the button. Oh well. So, 
Are those all my choices? Is I can only choose the rooms? Well, what about if we go into wall technology? No, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead, give it a shot. Oh, hmm, guess it's still in development. What? Right, okay, moving along. No, I want to walk through this wall. I'm going to walk around it. Walk through this way. No. Wally. Well, it's okay. It's just a demo. They're probably they're gonna fix that for the real game. Don't I? I won't worry that, that they're gonna. How's fix the it. anticipation? Still feeling it? Final choice, I guess. This is my only. It says exit. Do you still like the Stanley Parable? Can't go that way. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. Oh. Oh, wait, that's right. We haven't even started the real game yet. This is because I can't hold still for three seconds. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Well, now However, I know how video it's game still demos important made. that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, can't mental, physical, or otherwise, sun. that may occur you while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Nothing? Where's, where's the disagree no objections? button? You're where's the red sure disagree button? Oh, well, all right then. In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. Please perform a dance. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, perform that dance and I will terminate the demo immediately. Oh, yes. Right. All preparations have been made. It is time All I can do is remember last. that exact... Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? The demo! Charge! Where the... Let's see. Can I, can I walk away from this? If I wouldn't want to go to the door. It looks like I don't have much of a choice, do I? I can't avoid that door. Here we go. Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to Did the Stanley not... Parable demonstration. Your number is twenty-nine. Who's just when here? Your number is displayed. Please enter the demonstration room. Thank but, you, and have a pleasant demonstration. I was twenty-eight. This... Don't cheat me out like that. Okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to wait for my number this time. Well, let's see if anything's changed. Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable Demo Take 2. Finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. Sure. What's this? What, what's this button do? Click. Eight. Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's this is all wrong. This isn't the eight. Stanley Parable. This eight. is a game where you press a button and it says eight. I love this game. Not only is the Stanley Parable not a game about eight. continuously pressing the number eight, <laughs> I can <laughs> guarantee so that eight. this button does not appear anywhere in the main game. Why is it here instead of the demo for the Stanley Parable? Where did the demo go? Eight. There was an actual demo here before. Something has Eight. gone wrong. It's all gone horribly wrong. 
We need to Eight. get you out of here before you start forming impressions of Eight. the Stanley Parable based on whatever the hell this ape game is. We need to get out. We need to start over. You mustn't Eight. stay Eight. here another minute. Out, Eight. out, Eight. out. Go, go, go. Eight. 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 Imagine if this had been the demo. What would you have been thinking? You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about. None whatsoever. So wait, I don't get to play the 8 game? Oh, I guess I have to go backward. No more 8 game. Let's figure out what happened to the Stanley Parable. Demo. Why has it gone horribly wrong? Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, demonstration. The time. Yeah, Welcome yeah. Let's go this way. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the 8 game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. At this time, please take a minute <laughs> to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. I'm sorry. Alright guys, so I have made a huge mistake. It, it, it looks like I, I'm, I, I just dis I made the wrong decisions, you know? We wound up playing a game where we press the button 8. Wonderful. I could really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Let the demonstration begin! Begin! Where's my 8 button? 8. 8. What? No! It can't be over yet. You no. don't see anything. Everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience worth your time and money. It was here somewhere, I'm sure of it. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do, anything. The demo cannot end like this. Yeah, we need oh, an hurry, eight game. Hurry, this way. This way. Storage. Oh, I'm trapped. I need to play the eight game. Okay, yes. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. Okay, okay. Oh, how about this cup? Yes. Go pick up the cup. All right. Now put it um um in the bin. Ah, my favorite. You did it! You won! Yay! You know what you get for winning? An achievement. Wow, the Stanley Parable just keeps getting better and better. In fact, let me take a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? Uh... uh. You I'm responded. Gonna... What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. Oh, you of really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. <sighs> oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't we? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. Yay. Ending, ending. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there's the disagree button. Come on, I want to disagree to those terms and conditions. Whoa, now we're getting a whole blurred action sequence thing. Is this it? Uh... Yes, the end. Now, this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Do I do I get to go anywhere? What? That's it? Oh, I, I still like the game, but can I click the button? Is it working? I are you sure? You sure you press the button? What? No. We we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? 
They already finished. They said they liked it. I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? We need to go back. We need to get out of here. What? Oh, no. What's going on? Where is everyone? Where's okay, the eighth game? Over to the left. Down this way. Down... Oh. This is where we were before. I remember this. Isolation chamber. Isolation chamber. There we go. Oh. Peaceful. Nice and quiet. Nice and Finally. quiet. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher. And I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be. But, but somehow I couldn't. Uh, yeah. Well... At any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? Yes. Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No. I think I've had enough of it. No more doors. No more demonstrations. No. No more endings. I want to play. That's the other problem with this game. There's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, but back at the beginning of the demonstration now... That was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going. No confusion. Just a blank slate. Peaceful blank yes, slate. that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey. <laughs> Do you remember? Just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time. Oh, and I no, showed I you the technology used to make the demo. Because I thought there actually was a demo. <laughs> oh, we were so naive <laughs> back what? then. How little we knew of the world. I'm and then confused. when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before. Yes. Wait, what? It's no, no. so fresh in my wanna, I want to get out of here. They were such wonderful uh. moments. Oh, and then when we played the game with the cup and you won. Oh, and then we kept cup wandering game. and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere. And we just kept climbing and climbing, flight Wait. after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. We didn't and do this. we were on some kind of catwalk. I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? We didn't do this. And we just kept going, and we found that elevator, and it said escape on it. And we talked about it for a while, about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but that it seemed worth a try, and at the very least it would be an adventure. So we got inside, and we rode the elevator up and up and up. We had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't How possibly know, I'm not know going when. Down. And then after so long, it finally stopped, and we stepped out into the lush outdoors, the trees, Come on, the let wildlife, me out. the sun rising on a new and glorious path. Let me out. Freedom. We were free. There was nothing to think, nothing no. to know. Let me out. Simply us being right there. Let in me that out. Moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? This is... Uh, Wasn't uh, that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? Uh, cup game. We Eight game. Uh, let me out. No! No, let me in. Let me in. What? That's the demo? Well. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. Yeah, I hope you are a little less confused than I am. I'm completely baffled and a bit... I don't know if I want to say upset because I really want to play the game now. But, I mean, I was kind of hoping we'd get to make some decisions. If you want to really play uh, uh, the original Stanley Parable, I believe it's on Steam, um, it, it has that same announcer guy, and he tells you to go through various doors, and you can choose to go through them or go through different doors, and it, it actually gets pretty deep with the story and about how the, the meaning of life, how you can just blindly follow a path that someone leads out for you, or you can uh, just hang in the... and just ignore them and make a story of your own. It's, it's very interesting, actually. You should definitely play the original game. This demo, though... 
I think what you see is what you get with the demo. I'm, uh, I'm, I'll hopefully you'll get to see me play some more of the real game on the uh, the Snorri Dev channel in the future. Uh, I'm Toby, and uh, this has been the very confusing Stanley Parable demo. Goodbye.